The process of monetary transactions, which started off with only cash, then moved to debit and credit cards, has now moved to mobile wallets. Expert says this would be the next wave of innovation in digital payments. There are two types of mobile wallets, open and semi-closed. Open wallet has a bank as a shareholder, where a semi-closed wallet is not linked to a bank. Open wallet allows cash withdrawal as it is linked to a bank but not semi-closed wallet. These mobile wallets are regulated by the RBI except for those which are used for transactions with one merchant. Many at times, mobile wallet is confused with mobile banking but it is a more evolved process which makes mobile as a mode of payment. It doesn't rely on hard cash. Vijay Shekhar Sharma, Chairman and MD of Paytm Mobile Solutions says that credit cards and debit cards which were the rage till some years ago will soon be redundant once mobile wallet come to be used more widely. The major participants in mobile wallet segment include telecom service providers like Vodafone's M-Pesa, Bharti Airtel's Airtel Money, Aircel's Mobile Money and Tata Tele Services' m Organizations like Paytm and Mobiquick are also gaining ground in this segment. It also has sufficient layers of security in the software and as the wallet is in the mobile, it is trackable in case of theft. Mobile wallets are safer and more secure as compared to cards and hard cash as they add a security layer in terms of software. The security layer can be either passwords or voice recognition and in case of some phones like iPhones, it can also be biometrics. There is scope to add more intelligence to the software to make it even more secure, which can't be done in case of card, says Paytm Sharma. Ovum Consulting, a global ICT and telecom-focused advisory and research firm, says that a mobile wallet can support both mobile proximity and remote payments. Mobile wallets use a host of technologies including 2G, 3G, Wi-Fi, SMS, NFC, Bluetooth or QR codes. Those days won't be far away when you will be paying for coffee or groceries or any other purchase, not in cash or card, but through your mobile.